loading. I'll show you the uh, Java code. Uh, this is the folder, technical stuff folder. And I have this first folder and the second folder. The first folder contains the hello world.java. I'll just open the code and briefly explain you what it is. A single line code is what I would like to call it. Here it says, uh, it's, it's trying to print this first class gets loaded. Okay. First class gets loaded. This is what it's, it, it tries to print. And then I'm trying to sleep. Okay. Which means I'm going to pause the execution for three minutes before, you know, this particular Java code completes its execution. So this is my first class. Okay. Uh, for, okay. First folders class and the name is hello world or Java. Now I'll go back to the second uh, class. The code is exactly the same. Again, it is called hello world or Java. The only difference is here. It says second class gets loaded. This is the only difference. So the output of the execution of this class and that class would differ there. It will print the first class gets loaded. Here is going to print the second class gets loaded. So let's go ahead and do the compilation for both of these classes. So here I am in the folder called as first. Okay. So let me just go ahead and do the compilation. I'll com compile the hello world class. Okay. So, so we've done with the compilation and if I execute this class, you will see first class gets loaded and now it is going to sleep for three minutes. So this is the execution of the first class. Now let's go ahead and compile the uh, second class uh, Java code compilation for second Java code. And now I'll execute the second Java class. That's it. So here it says second class gets loaded and now it's going to pause. So you saw that, you know, I moved in the first folder compiled and ran the first uh, Java code, uh, which is hello world dot class. And again, I'm running the hello world class, which is in the second folder. The output is different. First class gets loaded here. The output is second class gets loaded.